Hello everybody and welcome to Draft Horses, the show that doesn't recognize Dr. Pepper as a medical professional. I'm Tim Splosion. I'm Fizzy. I'm Best Acrylic. I'm Anxiety Monster. And I'm Ronin20181. So on previous episodes of Draft Horses, we've had shipping two different ways now. And it's time for us to try something a little bit different. It's time that these artists got really stuck in and put their hooves right in the mix. Today, we are going to be doing self-insert shipping. The four artists that are with that are with me now, we are going to be spinning a randomizer wheel, and they will be offering up their pony OCs as fodder for whatever insane shipping ends up happening out the other side of this. Our OCs yeah. will be sacrificed to the great shipping lords. Yeah, the, the great goddess of love, Princess Cadence, demands that your OCs submit themselves to romantic relationships with, Finally. with fictional horses <laughs> yeah with fictional horses as as god intended yeah there's really not much more to say than that would anyone like to volunteer to go first uh yeah sure i go pastor tell us a little bit about your pony oc first well my pony oc is technically a changeling disguised as a oh. pegasus pony uh, uh, he is very fluffy uh, that's a very important point. Quite small too, and she looks kind of like a dog. It has a floppy ear and a color and a little a little fang that's sticking out of her little mouth. Heck and yeah. big glasses and very big glasses. That's very important. This is good. Let's see who this changeling Pegasus fluffy dog is going to be going on a date with. Okay, so Milky Way Last and. Oh, we need to come up with ship names for every single one. We do. Yes. Okay, your pony OC will be shipped with Sapphire Shores, the pony of pop from it, uh, season one. It's gorgeous. Okay, great. You are lucky. <laughs> you are a lucky You're... woman. I'm lucky to have gotten a mare. <laughs> <laughs> Let me look up how she looks like again because I forgot. Yeah, she's she's one of the one of the few ponies in season one who has a unique body oh, yeah. type. Yeah, you're right. Oh yeah. Interesting. You're I'm not a fan fun. of the fact that she wears clothes. <laughs> <That's gonna lie. laughs> How am I going to do this? One thing I can offer up, if you need a situation, I do have a secret second wheel what? that has on it a Blast bunch this. of different romantic settings. Oh. I didn't I didn't know if we were gonna use this, but if a you're having trouble with wheel. situations, I can Yeah, I, I suck at situation, especially like okay. shipping. Okay, so let's take a look. I'm spinning the situation wheel oh now. My God. You oh, and my Sapphire Shores will be doing a beach, beach sunset. sunset, romantic Great. evening on the beach. That works. Sapphire Great. Shores on a on a beach shore. Oh, that is perfect, actually, isn't it? Okay, this is the return of the great old mighty wheel. Yep. Let's call it the Wheel of Fortune. Let's copyright that before <laughs> anyone else can take it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no one else has thought of that before. We gotta take it. No one has. No, <laughs> it's, it's never come up. No one has ever put those two words together. <laughs> I have a very short attention span. I can't, I'll be honest, I can't watch every episode without like pausing and leaving for like a day. <laughs> That's totally valid. That's why I just leave it playing in the background. I need to start doing that. I need to get caught up on the draft horses more. So you you don't you don't know why Horston Powers is one of the sticker packs that's available on our Kofi right now. No, I saw that sticker and I'm like, who is this? self insert sponsorship? I should do a discount code, shouldn't I? Like for people watching the episode. Okay, yeah. <laughs> We're only a few minutes in and we've already had our first delete your art moment. Yeah, oh, no. I'm going to do a lot of that because <laughs> I'm trying to figure out uh, uh, how I'm going to frame this. I'm not sure what position we should be in. Okay, okay, this is this is off to a cute start. Have you guys oh heard God. of the Minecraft movie? There's yes, a Minecraft I've movie? Heard. There's I've going to be... It's going to be live action, and Dino is going to play the main character. So Steve, live action, is going to be played by Jack Black. <sighs> I'm so glad yes. it's not Chris Pratt. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. They did that purely for the memes, because he does not fit anything. Oh no, Steve. he does not. But I don't care. I don't fucking give a single talk. <laughs> Jack Black as Steve is the funniest shit ever. Isn't the this whole is point of big. Minecraft that it's blocky? What's what's exactly? Uh, now I'm just imagining 
it's gonna be Jack Black, just normal looking live action Jack Black, but he's like been green screened into Minecraft. And that's, it. <laughs> <laughs> that's probably the funniest it's way of doing like, it. It's gonna be like Jumanji where they get sucked into the game and they have to escape the game. That's what my assumption is. Like, we've already seen wanna, Jack Black like, in a Jumanji movie. If if I wanted that, I would go back and watch yeah, the two Jumanji movies. Jack Black and Jumanji. Oh, yeah. And he was great in Jumanji. I love that. Okay, I think I have a feel for how I'm going to do oh, things, so cute. maybe it's time oh, yeah. to. Time for the big sketch. <laughs> it's time to do, 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 do your taxes. <laughs> I do need to do mine actually. One of the downsides of, of living in Canada, I have to, I have to actually like manually file taxes now. Let's not get into politics. Taxes do indeed suck. What do you mean? I think taxes and politics is a great subject to talk about for this episode. <laughs> you see the status that's implied by the H1B visa. <laughs> I'm already lost. I want to please pick me up for school. I don't want to be. <laughs> Why didn't they teach us about taxes in school? You wouldn't have listened then either. That's true. <laughs> my cat is currently on my lap and is watching, so watching jealous. the art. Uh... Yes, yes, cat picture. I love cats. Cats are my favorite. Cat. Aww, the litter. Oh, look at the baby! She's watching the, the thing. That's yeah. So she's watching the whole She's watching Asta draw. Asta, you have another audience. You should feel fresh enough. <laughs> Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm very scared suddenly. Yeah, if you don't draw well, uh, Tim's cat will be very displeased and then burn his house down. Fizzy also showed off her cat. Let me get you. She's really ugly. I'm so sorry. She's oh. not ugly. How no, dare I'm you? Really... Oh, me! So that so is ugly. a. She's so pretty. Is... She's a pretty kitty. You're so mean. Aww. Look at that is but a sweet bean. Look at her. The only part of her that's fully no, colored no, no. in is her tail. The picture of Anxiety's cat with the fucking Santa hat. It looks so sad. It looks so sad. What did you do? He doesn't like his hat. He he's upset about his hat. He doesn't Aww. like it. Oh. Yeah, they're what brothers. Puppies. That's the one the, in the frog we... hat is Oswald, and the one in the Santa hat is Momo. Oh. So Oswald. Momo, Momo looks. Yeah. Momo looks so sad. He Momo is really so sad. does look sad. He doesn't like it. <laughs> He's about to cry. In my defense about my cat, she does beat up the senior cats that I have. Okay, so she's not ugly on the outside, she's ugly on the inside. <laughs> exactly. Right, okay. That makes it better. The one where she's like hanging off the side of the couch does make her look like yeah. she's got absolutely jacked arms. Like, that is a she cat that not. lifts weights. So the thing with Pretzel <laughs> is, she's the size of a six month old kitten. But she weighs four kilograms. Like, <laughs> she is just all muscle. Big kitty. Big hench. tough kitty. She's so hench. What a word to describe your cat. <laughs> she is. Like, she's just all. She's tiny, but she's all muscle. For her first birthday, I got, I got Pretzel a little bow tie. We were going to take pictures of her with a little present. And Ew. within seconds, she had torn the bow tie to shreds. Our boys used to wear collars when we first got them as kittens, but Oswald would just like tear his his up so it was like really frayed. And Momo kept figuring out how to unclip it somehow and just take it off. Mm. We ended yeah. up just not having them wear collars because they're indoor cats, so they don't like go outside anyways. <laughs> but it was like not working at all. My cat Cleo, she hates collars. Like she found a way to like sort of get it lodged on something and pull so it would unclasp. So we just find That's collars so around the house. I need to stop sending photos of my cats because I have an album of over 500 pictures of them. <laughs> oh yeah, I have kidding. way too many pictures of my cat too. <laughs> oh yeah. They're my babies. I gotta take pictures every time I look at them. If they weren't meant for taking pictures of, why are they so cute? Exactly. exactly. Welcome to favorites. welcome to today's draft horses episode where we welcome will to draft be cats, cat pictures and cat videos and nothing else. It's gonna be a cat slideshow and then it'll just cut back and Pass's art is completely finished. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Wishful thinking there. I know this sketch is coming along. I am surprised how fast I'm being right now. It's so cute so far. I mean. all, I, all I see are cats. It's very cute. I love how you do ears. How you do ears is really cute. Thank you. Yep. I really enjoy drawing ears. Good question. Do you guys do you guys think My Little Ponies 
how big do you think they are? I oh. always thought they were about the size of a cat or a big dog or a small dog. That's what I yeah, think too. Yeah. Like you can okay. just pick them up. But I've also seen like I don't know what it's from. It's like a blooper short of like a question girl's Rainbow Dash riding regular Rainbow Dash. Yeah, which it's is a blooper really short. Weird. So it's, like, it's not canon. Yeah. Uh, but it like it kind of gives you an idea of the size, and it was really interesting because Rainbow Dash, Pony like Rainbow Dash, was much bigger than I thought she would be. She's See, the size I, of a I, horse, and I don't know why they would do that because that's crazy. Like full horse, horse, or like like no, real no, life like, pony I'm horse. joking. I'm joking. She's big enough the size to of be a ridden. Pony. Yeah. Okay. She's the size of an actual pony. When, when you see how big they are compared, like I know how big a rabbit is, right? And I see Fluttershy with Angel. I'm just like, well, if real rabbit is this size and Fluttershy is this size compared to a rabbit, I feel like that would make her pretty close to the size of an actual real life pony. Although I suppose my regular size pony isn't as good of a brand name. Regular <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> size pony. Well, yeah. you do know how my little normal pony size horses. Normal size horses. <laughs> Uh, My little pony uh, was. Uh, <laughs> I used to wonder what horses could be. <laughs> My little Sorry. pony. <laughs> My little pony is technically a spin-off of uh, a toy line that kind of failed. That was called My Pretty Pony, which was oh, uh, pretty much the same the same toys as T1, except uh, colored like normal horses and much bigger. Oh, I remember seeing about that. And My Little Pony was basically like My Pretty Pony, but small and with different colors, so you could collect them. I used to wonder really? what the horses could be. <laughs> <laughs> so you all showed the horses to me. <laughs> That's a horse. That's also a horse. Look over there. It's also a horse. <laughs> What's that? Another Why horse horses. and horses all are complete. Over the field. <laughs> <laughs> oh my, no more horses. Uh, Don't you know that I... you are all a horse? <laughs> you are what? <laughs> you are all a horse. Watching the show is like a curse. You turn into a horse as soon as you finish <laughs> watching the intro. Yeah, I can confirm. That's what happened to me. <laughs> Wanna know how I got these moves? <laughs> <laughs> Really <laughs> Man, there's so many season one ponies from the show that just disappeared immediately. Twist. Right yeah, that's what, that's what happens with uh, season ones of a lot of shows. Yeah, yeah they, true, tr true. they try a lot of stuff out in the early seasons. Sepesta, what's your what's your thinking with the with the white around the edges? Here? It's just to help me frame it better, because that's an issue I've been having with my art. I feel like my compositions aren't very good, and it's mostly because I tend to draw in a big white void and then worry about the, the framing. So I've been trying to frame things before I begin actually inking and coloring. So the, the white border helps me see the edge of the actual art better. Nice. It's it's a pretty bad way of going about it. <laughs> uh, I should just be making my canvas the size of the art I'm trying, but I'm used to doing it this way, so... Okay, so I think the sketch is done. This sketch is super cute. I'm guessing the sunset and the beach and stuff, that's gonna come in in the coloring phase, isn't it? With the, with the uh, lighting. Actually, I kind of dropped it because the framing, as you can see, is mostly centered it's very on the tight. ponies. So... Okay. <laughs> Fair enough, fair enough. It's still very cute art. And yeah, the final thing will be on screen right now. I think that's adorable. So yeah, your your pony OC. Milky uh, Way. Milky Way. Milky Way and really Sapphire cute. Shores. That's very cute. Okay, guys, now the most important task. Ship name. Ooh. Sapphire Way or... The Milky Sapphire Shores. Way, Milky, Sh Milky Shores. Mm. Mm. Not sure about that one. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what about Starry Gem? Because you got the Milky Way and the Sapphire. That's cute. Very good. Or you could have Mafia Shores. Yeah, Milfire. Milfire. We'll... Milfire. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. We got it. Milfire. We got it. Yep, that's the one. That's the one. We're Let's going go. with that. Milfire. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. Yeah, we'll move on to the next artist then. Anxiety Monster. Would you like to be up? Yeah. 
Heck yeah. Firstly, Anxiety, would you like to introduce your pony OC? Yes. Okay, so my pony OC, my pony Sona, isn't that interesting. <laughs> I made my first Sona years before my pony Sona. My first Sona's name is Anxiety. It's very surprising. And then when I started getting into my little pony, I basically just turned my persona into a pony. It's basically like kind of a persona. copy of my persona yes, design. And my pony sona's name is Candy Cane Rose. Nice. Very cute. Aww. It's got that like wolf cutie mark. Yeah, that's like, actually that... supposed to be my persona. Nice. Like, Hell yeah. I was also very uncreative with the cutie mark because I didn't really <laughs> want to do a pencil or a pen because I feel like a lot of cutie marks are that way with pony sonas. Yeah. I kind of put my fursonas like sort of. That's not what my fursona. I don't even know. You know what? I give up. I don't know what it is. It's, it's there because it's <laughs> cool. That, that's how <laughs> my, my cutie mark is just nothing. Hit your fursona with a ponify pony. You know what? Screw you, unponies your sona. <laughs> 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 well, let's see who your pony sona is going to be romantically entangled with today. Come on. Come on, Smooze. Come on, Smooze. Come on, Smooze. And you've got Rarity. Rarity. Ooh, Ooh lucky one. Do you like Rarity? Rarity. Now, would you like the romantic situation wheel, or do you? would you like to just kind of think of a, a situation? Give me the wheel. Give okay. Me the wheel. wheel time. The um, second wheel. Let's see what we've got. Random bullshit, go. Dancing at a gala or wedding. Oh, that's perfect. Okay. Oh, oh my god. I'm going to make this harder for myself and draw her gala uh, outfit. Yes. <laughs> Gotta think of, like... Oh, does that mean I have to give my pony Sona an outfit, too? You think Rarity <laughs> would let you go to a gala without a dress? <laughs> I think you should ponify the costume that Luz in the Owl House wears to Grom. Oh. Is it the one like the other yeah. head? It's the it's the the it's suit on gender. top, dress on bottom. It's very. Oh gender. right, no, never mind. Yeah. I mean, you could do the other one, see if you wanted to. The other one. Oh. Yeah, the other with the dark side. Okay, I'm gonna try and draw pony dancing, but let's see <laughs> if I decide <laughs> against it. Look at look at you go, anxiety. You are drawing fast. <laughs> I yeah, really off fast. to the races. Faster than I am. So I usually get each maybe artwork done in like an hour and a half at the most. Oh, no. nice. thirty minutes. I don't know. I think That's I'm just impressive. impatient. It can like always be better, but I'm just kind of like I gotta, I gotta draw this now. I gotta finish it. <laughs> nah, I, I respect that. That is amazing. You get me on a very fundamental level because it's I a... can't spend too long on a piece or I will drive myself insane. Oh my god, so true. It's the ADHD. Absolutely. I promise. So true. <laughs> and also, you, you have your style like down so well. Oh yeah. You know exactly what you are. Sometimes I so need to reference my own art to know what my style looks like. <laughs> I know, right? It's I can't so remember true. it. I might have to actually it's bring so up a picture of a rarity I've drawn because I had like a whole thing of how I draw rarity, but I don't draw her enough so I can't like remember it. When you have to look at like when you haven't drawn in a long time, so I have to look at the like <laughs> sketches of your old artwork so you know what the hell your exactly. style is. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Oh my exactly. god, I hate I'm glad I'm not the only one. <laughs> Man, being a unicorn must suck because you can't sleep with your face down. That's so true. true. Why would you sleep with your face down? You'll. <laughs> I do that. How do you do breathe? Okay. Well, you know, I mean, if you end up not breathing, then like, at least you don't have work in the morning. You, uh, you, hey, when you when you don't breathe, you pass out anyway. So hey, I go to sleep even faster. <laughs> that doesn't sound healthy. I gotta, I gotta say, I'm, I'm liking the posing on this. Thank you. Like it does read as dancing. Oh, I'm so glad. Coming out adorable. Thank it's you. Very cute. It is. I'm still very figuring cute. out how to draw my pony Sona's tail because it's changed slightly over the years. I don't know. I think that. I have fine. to say, I'm very jealous. You get to date with Rarity. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Rarity. Oh, me too. God, I love her. I've been reading Rekindled Embers re recently, which is a really good fanfic, and it's got a lot of good rarity stuff, and it's been making me really like rarity more. Rarity's awesome. They really put in there for the dramatic people, and I appreciate that. <laughs> really need that overdramatic bitch representation. <laughs> I did this a while ago. 
I like the colors I picked, so I want to use this. It's a, it's like a softer version of the colors. She normally yeah. has quite quite a dark quite a dark blue for the main. Yeah. Also, this reminded me when I was doing a project for Prince Whatever. I had not drawn most of the main six. Like out of the main, main six, I have drawn only two of them consistently, which is Rainbow and <laughs> and Twilight. They're my favorite. Over the course of that whole video, I had to learn how to draw them. So, like if you watch the video that I drew for him, you can immediately tell that I hadn't drawn those characters before and I was like slowly morphing oh, no. them into my style over the course of the whole video. So they look like very different throughout the whole video. Okay, I'm doing her tail from memory because the picture I chose doesn't have her tail. I think I had the most trouble with rarities and Fluttershy's hair. Because something about oh, Fluttershy's true. hair makes it so tough like to it's get it right. It's so long and if you make it too long or too short it looks weird. Yeah, I think the best thing for me is remembering that her mane makes kind of a heart shape, and that usually helps. Oh, the yeah, yeah, I, I that's remember true. That as well. It's always it's always in the swirlies where rarity stuff gets complicated. You have to do it from like the back of her head. Uh, yeah, you're giving yourself quite a challenge this. here. I know. I had a vision. I'm sticking to it. I had a dream. I'm here to tell. Oh, her hair's different. Whatever. I'm not going off a cannon. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how to draw that. That's crazy. That's cute though. But that's crazy. <laughs> crazy? That was crazy once. No! I'm not getting into they that. They locked me in a room. A rubber room. For some reason, what I like to do is to draw like um, diamonds growing from her like hooves. Huh? Like it'll it'll look hmm. better in like the actual ending, but I did yeah. that for like a couple of things on my TikTok. It's different from the usual kind of like fat locks that people give ponies. Oh, I need to do the loose outfit. Uh, I'll just do. Well, you could just give your something. pony. A, yeah, just give your pony a tie. Yeah, because they they wouldn't wear like a skirt, but I do love the outfit that they did for loose. Loose oh food loose. Get on your fucking food loose. <laughs> feet, food feet. Get on your fucking feet. <laughs> Sandman, man me a sand, do 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 do, <laughs> make him the cutest mandel hook hand. <laughs> Amazing. What if I draw a dress from the back? I'm bad at drawing dresses anyways. Maybe she's also in a suit. Oh, Rarity in a suit. It's, that would be so pretty. She wouldn't wear a suit. Maybe she would, actually. I don't know. Where he is always about way. bold fashion choices. I'm gonna make it harder for myself. She'd wear a suit, but it would be like a crop top. It'd be like one of those one of those magician's apprentices suits. Oh, yo, she so would though. With like the bodysuit underneath. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh. Yeah, it's hard because that like the the dress in the reference has like so many layers of ruffles. Yeah, and it covers up her tail, and I drew her tail. Yeah. Maybe I should take away her tail? Okay, here's oh, what I'm what? gonna do. I'm gonna save the tail, but erase it, and just see which looks better. Rarity, why are you so complicated? You're so <laughs> good at making outfits, but I don't know how to draw them. <laughs> That's the downside of her being so extra. Okay, I might- Absolutely. I don't think I can figure this out. I'm really bad at outfits. Plus, I want to keep her hooks. What? I might yeah. just do it where she's not wearing an outfit. Although, err, that's not what she would do. She would not do that. My she would head, always wear an my, outfit. My cannon demands. <laughs> the voices. The voices. <laughs> please. In, in season one, she does have a dress saddle that she was trying to put on Twilight, doesn't she? Yep. Yeah, but that was really ugly and I hated it. <laughs> that's valid. I'm that's sorry, valid. Rarity. To be honest, that, okay, that I, I have to hit. be honest. A lot of the clothing that they designed it earlier were kind of ugly. Oh, what if she's wearing a cape, like a cloak? It could be like a fancy one, so it can still have like gems or sparkles or something around around the base of it. Yeah, like long and flowy and like, but not as complex as a dress. I don't know how to draw. Okay, I'm doing my best. Probably edit it. 
since I don't know how to do clothes very well. And this and this way as well, you can still have the you can still have the tail sticking out from under invisible. Okay, I think I'm about done. I'll probably do like the harder stuff later on, because it's gonna take a lot of thinking and erasing uh, and redoing. You're relatively happy with this as the sketch for now? Relatively, yes. Okay. So this is adorable. Thank you. <laughs> I love how you draw pony faces. I I've said it before, it's still true, I need to commission you at some point. Oh, uh, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you. So, we've got Candy Cane Rose X Rarity. What do people think the ship name should be? Candy T. Rarity. Kennedy. 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 <laughs> Kennedy. 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 No. John F. Kennedy? <laughs> Get down, Mr. President. <laughs> um, Get down! Oh, no, no, no. John F. Kennedy was named after this chest. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's 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 always rare candy, which is both a Pokemon reference and a name combination. True. Yeah. Any other ideas? I mean, I like for ca rare candy. Okay. Yeah, yeah. rare candy. We'll rare go with candy? we'll go with rare candy. Yeah. Yeah. We'll go with that for now. And if uh, someone shouts out a better one in the comments, we'll pretend that that one was the intended one this whole time. Okay. So that brings us on to our third artist of the day. Ronan, would you like to step up next? So Ronan, would you like to tell us a little bit about your Pony OC? It is a character with a name, and he is indeed a horse of some description. His name is Ronan, can you imagine? His last name is actually Vigil. He's just a shy little Pegasus horse with who draws, like me. Surprise, I know. His cutie mark is also a sword, a pen and a sword, because... And it's my dude in a sword. He's a That's very, cute. very oh, basic, yeah. lore deprived <laughs> stallion. All my other OCs have have the uh, interesting bits. Mine has not. Well, someone out there will see something very special in even a simple pony such as Ronan. And we're about to find out who that is. So I'm spinning the wheel. Fancy pants. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> so Ronan, how, how are you feeling about Ronan X oh, fancy pants? I hate my life. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that's okay. That's okay. We might be able to improve it by looking at the situation. So let's take a look. See what situation we spin up. Oh, that's sweet. Hot air balloon ride. Oh, cute. Yeah, you can take a ride in in Twilight's balloon. There's like nine salians in this whole wheel, and I got the worst one. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, would you consider fancy pants better or worse than bulk biceps? <laughs> it's true. Shipping. No matter who wins, we lose. <laughs> that is funny as well. Side note. Recently, I went bowling for the first time, which was very nice. I had a lot nice. of fun with my friends. But the problem was, I never went bowling before, so I held the bowling ball wrong, and I hurt my wrist. Oh, um, uh, yeah, that can yeah. that can happen. My, I, I'm drawing a little slower than I usually would. That's okay. It, it'll it'll get sped up in the edit anyway. Why is Big Mac? <laughs> you prefer Big Mac? Absolutely valid. So valid. You, valid. You, I mean, you wouldn't, wouldn't you wouldn't have gone for would. you wouldn't have gone for caramel apple or Braver? Oh, Braver. They're all they're all good. I love Braver. <laughs> but but Big Mac, Big Mac was the first one I saw. I'm very glad I didn't get a stallion. I know we could gender swap them, but what? No, shh, shh. nothing. No, nothing we, 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 we can gender swap them. Never mind. <laughs> uh, I mean, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna anyway. I am sticking to this role. The funny thing, he's like the combination of every character trait in the pony that I hate. Well, not hate, just <laughs> like mildly dislike. Which is he's, he has facial hair, which on his face, which doesn't make sense. He's also wearing clothes for a pony, and a lot of it too. And also, he's an aristocrat. <laughs> oh dear. That's the worst part, is the class traitor of him. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do have the added difficulty of having to draw a hot air balloon. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's just a little funny. It's not too bad, it's just a little airborne. It's a little airborne. <laughs> I mean, my boy's a package. It's just fine. Simpsons Sorry. reference. I, I did. I did not expect the Simpsons reference right now. I'm like binging the Simpsons right now. So, Rona, when, when you when you're imagining your your pony on this on this date, do you imagine the the date's going well? Ideally, 
guess. I, okay. I don't want to imagine a ship scenario where it's like, oh man, they're shipped together, but they don't actually having that much great. That's a fucking. Fair. Right. Fair. Like, even, even though I don't like the character very much, this is the hand I've been dealt, and I shall play my best. Because <laughs> <laughs> Ronan would never date a man like this. <laughs> how, much is it, how much is an editor to cost, do you think? Uh, I more than I can afford. Maybe, maybe we should do some research on that. But canning that idea for later. If people watching are interested in helping out with Google Drive storage costs, you can buy sticker packs over on Kofi. Plug, 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 Still enough that I'd, I'd like to. Services used to be cheaper. Yeah, once upon a time. I've been enjoying yeah. this hot air balloon more than I've been enjoying <laughs> ponies, because I it's was cute. putting off the inevitable. Yeah, you've been delaying it. Have you guys ever ridden a hot air balloon? No, it sounds like the worst no, thing ever. Because <laughs> you know, you know what I like when I'm several thousand feet in the air. Uh, absolutely no control. Uh... Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there's nothing more appealing than just open space to fall out of. Ugh, I no, never. I think I would like to hard ride on hard Berlin. Yeah, me too. I think I I'd, I'd enjoy it. I can see the appeal. I feel like I don't know how I would react until I was there. Like I would either be like fine the whole time, or I would like feel sick and be like, oh god, I'm gonna fall out of this thing. So uh, true. true, true. I, I've got um, no like idea it, which. It, it seems so magical though. It seems so magical. It does. It seems magical, but you're probably up there for hours in that little basket. That's why you gotta go pee beforehand. <laughs> yeah. Either that'll pray someone I mean, brought a bottle. You, you can, <laughs> there's open space everywhere. You can just go. <laughs> oh, exactly. Oh no. Oh no. Fertilize like the ground below. People, like, Who's like going to on. see you from so far up? Who's gonna stop you? God? Yes. <laughs> yes, who's who's going to who's going to see your massive colorful balloon? They won't know it's me. <laughs> like to say something else. <laughs> <laughs> this is a family friendly show. What is going no, on? It's no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Don't lie to Echo talk this about boobs the, the last time she was on. Like, <laughs> I must have missed that part. This ain't your grandma's draft horses. <laughs> Oh my. Do you think Twilight ever got the intrusive thought to throw Spike out of the balloon? Yeah. Like, immediately, yes. yes. Absolutely. <laughs> I just... How would she not? She I love that Spike. Like... How dare you? I'm sure taking a Pegasus to fly would be maybe similar to a bird where you just kind of force it. Maybe she'd think that's how you fucking get his throw them wings. Off. Just throw them off. Be like, yo, you'll just know how to do it. And he's like, oh. Just Damn, can't believe Spike's fucking dead. <laughs> F's in the chat for Spike. I like Spike. He's now dead. He's he's I good. Like he's fine. Too, but he's dead, so <laughs> he's dead, so we can't do anything about that. He's just a little guy. That's illegal. Just a baby. So he's, he's a guy. <laughs> How did I draw wings? God, I draw wings. I flip flop between like so many ways of drawing them. <laughs> I need to reference it's myself. Here. I'm just thinking so much. About that. Oh, it is that. getting close to allergy season. Okay. Death season comes Ugh, near. I'm gonna uh, die. Oh no! Oh, you're right. Allergies are already really bad. I'm allergic to my cats, so I am always just <laughs> oh, no. in pain. <laughs> like that's probably why I sound so nasally. It's just because it's allergies constantly. 24 it's, it's, it's worth it for those babies. It's worth it. It is! They're my baby boys. I love them. They're so cute. Anyway, back to drawing. Now time for the faces and the clothes and the mustaches. <laughs> it's time to draw Mr. Fancy Pants, which I fucking hate. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe. Dude, I saw that name on the wheel and as it was coming closer to me, I was like, no. No! <laughs> you, no! you can't do this to me. Do not how much I sacrificed. <laughs> <laughs> I will give a nine for this. <laughs> and we're glad you're here. So Ronan, who do you think who do you think like set up this date? Do you reckon 
You reckon Ronan did, or do you reckon uh, Fancy Pants did? Not Ronan, that's for sure. <laughs> and Fancy Pants does seem like the type who'd be able to afford a, a, a hot air balloon right day. Hot air balloon, dude. So that, I mean, it would be weird if a Pegasus said, hey, let's want to go on a hot air balloon date, but they have balloons. <laughs> <laughs> true, okay, true. I was thinking about the Sonic Rain Boom episode, and when, like, Pinky first jumps out of the balloon, and Remedash is worried before before the reveal of, like, the spell. Oh, yeah. And I'm just I'm just imagining what if Pinky just <laughs> fell through the cloud, what if the spell hadn't worked? She just, she just died. The end. That's, <laughs> the show ends there. Friend. <laughs> Don't worry, Rainbow Dad. Roll credits. I love his little mustache. It's so cute. It is cute. I'll be honest. I do kind of like Fancy Pants because he kind of like breaks the stereotype in some ways. Sometimes he's greedy, but like the greedy stereotype, because he he was really nice to Rarity, um, even when he knew that she was from Ponyville and was really nice about her friends. Yeah, he, he is a fine person. I just don't like him aesthetically. That is honest. <laughs> That's valid. I hate how he looks. Oh, you're a fine person. I just don't like your vibes. <laughs> I hate you in every way possible, but I'm sure we could be friends. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I think you're a good person. I just think you're fuck ugly. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Out of my face. Like... Holy shit. But, you know. <laughs> I like you, I just hate looking at you. Yeah, see, there's nothing wrong with you as a person, but the sight of you makes me want to vomit. <laughs> like, if I could take your personality and put it on literally anyone else. <laughs> anyone else. Oh god. <laughs> this is just so bad. Slandering him. Uh, should have thought about that before he wore a suit and a fucking mustache as a fucking phone. <laughs> Dude, I remember, I... A uh, guy commissioned me once, and he commissioned me to draw his OC, and his OC had sideburns <laughs> as a pony, <laughs> and I was like, hmm, man, I mean, do what you want, man, but, uh. That's funny. He's gonna, he's gonna see this and be like, oh, <laughs> feel called out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, I want my money back. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys know that they made a Bob's Burgers episode about bronies? What? No. Uh huh? What? Yeah. No, I'm dead serious. It's really funny. I, I feel like I should have had it there. They call them equestronauts. Like, oh wait, no. <laughs> That's Hold amazing. On. Equestronauts is what the show is instead of My Little Pony. Right. No, equestronauts. And, That's amazing. Yeah, I can't remember. I think they called them something like equestricals like yes yes oh instead, of, instead of bronies i can't yeah, okay. it's something like that but it's so funny i'm just gonna give the basis basic premise i love bob's burgers and i freaked out when i saw the episode <laughs> tina loves the show the equestronauts and sees that there's a convention coming for it so she goes with her little toy horse from equestronauts and a bunch of grown men are there, and they're and all of them are kind of like, "What is happening?" <laughs> it's a convention full of grown men, just as equestronauts, and they're all really passionate about it. And one of them, dressed up as like a pink unicorn, swindles Tina out of her toy horse because it's actually really rare, no. but she didn't know that. Oh, and they no. realize it was really rare, so they they make Bob go in undercover as a brony. And try and oh infiltrate it and get the God. toy back. It's really Did good. It back? No spoilers. You guys got you gotta watch the. <laughs> you gotta watch the episode. episode. We are not sponsored by Bob's Burgers. <laughs> you got me hooked. You got me hooked today. It's probably my favorite like adult directed cartoon because like it's really rare for the family to not hate each other. The family really loves each other and shows that a lot. They have disagreements, but they never like. Like, each other, yeah, hate each mean. other. It's really, really yeah, sweet. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of modern adult in quotation uh, family cartoons are kind of like that. I'm trying to like, oh my god, I don't know what's wrong with me. I haven't finished the Owl House. Um, yeah, other shows okay, I'll, 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 okay. I'll do you one other... better. I haven't watched the Owl House. It's pretty good. Damn, you both need to I, get on there's it. Like, there's multiple shows that I started watching but haven't finished and they've come out with the last season. 
but I'm so determined to finish all 30 seasons of The Simpsons before I watch anything else. <laughs> I am so well, hooked on it right now. You know there's just going to be more, right? I know! <laughs> um, Asta, Pasta is like holding her raven. Wait, why? What about the Owl House? Yeah. <laughs> How dare you not watch the Owl House? I need to finish it. I've watched everything except the last episode. I think I'm just also okay. subconsciously I also disappointed that it was cancelled. I mean, it does yeah, still end with a satisfying ending. True. Okay, that's, that's good. Yeah, I think it's very satisfying. It wasn't rushed like Star vs. Forces of Evil. That ending single-handedly, like, put a, such a bad taste in my mouth. I know, I haven't so been able to watch the show again since I saw the ending. Plus, Mar- oh my god, Marco was supposed to be trans. Oh, hold on, I gotta talk about this. <laughs> what? Um, Go for it. If I remember- if I remember correctly, there's this whole- I can't remember why- This is going off a of memory from when, like, like, five years ago when the show was still running. There was this whole thing where Star and Marco had to infiltrate this princess thing, but they had to dress up as yeah, different princesses that. to disguise princess. themselves. And they named yeah, uh, Marco Princess Turbina, I think. And Marco yeah. ended up really, Probably really like liking the dress and being a princess and being called Princess Turbina. And I saw that, like, Marco was supposed to end up realizing that he was trans because of that. But, of course, it's Disney and they didn't want that. So I think I saw that, like, in the background of one episode, they had a little stuffed animal of Princess Turdina, and she was wearing a dress of the trans flag colors. Nice. Oh, I remember correctly. But yeah, Disney didn't allow a lot of that. Like, even Gravity Falls was trying to add a lot of LGBTQ stuff, but Disney just kept, kept getting pushed back. It fucking sucks. Yeah. Well, anyway, I've been jarred for a, a very long time now. This is essentially the rough. Cute. It's more It's romantic. cute. Thank you. Now, the, the ever important question. Shipmate. Ronin Ooh. Vigil and Ronin Pants. Ronin Pants. <laughs> Ronin Pants. Ronin Pants. I think Ronin Pants is the winner here. I love it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think this is a good end result. Um, and I can't wait to see the, the final piece on screen right now. Hell yeah. The final result will show right here. <laughs> what? Woo! That leaves us with one artist to go. Whew. Fizzy, how are you feeling having seen everyone else's art? I'm, I'm a little intimidated. Everyone's pulling out some really cute stuff. Well, I believe in you. Thank you. Your drawing will be even cuter than ours. <laughs> oh, there's also, a strong if you get possibility. Bash, I will kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, Fizzy, do you want to tell us about the OC you're bringing to the table today? Absolutely. Her name is Fizzy Whizbang. She is my other pony Sona. Mostly because, as much as I love Bitter Glitter, I don't think she would ever. She loves herself too much, you know? <laughs> <That's> real. <laughs> <laughs> Fizzy is my little bat pony unicorn hybrid. She has no cutie mark because she doesn't really know what she's doing. She, she has yet to find a purpose. Oh, but I love her. Aww. I mean, same. She's just hanging out. Maybe that's her talent. Just chilling. <laughs> yeah, her, her, her cutie mark could be oh. a sofa and a remote. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that'd be a lot of brony cutie marks. <laughs> <It's true. laughs> yeah, uh, uh, no offense to our audience, we're not talking about you, it's it's other people. I am. Actually, you... no. <laughs> I'm kidding. You, you right now, watching this. You specifically. Get off your ass. <laughs> let's see, let's see who Fizzy Whizbang is going on the date with. And it is... Twilight Velvet, Twilight yeah! Sparkles Mall. Yeah! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Oh, yeah! You're banging her mother! Would you do, you, do you, do you need a romantic situation or, or do you reckon you could take it from there? I think I got this. I think I think okay. I do, okay. do not even worry. Busy. You have the biggest flex out of all of us right now. Holy. <laughs> <laughs> You're dating Twilight Mom. Why is my pen doing that? Okay, so my, my tablet, it's because my phone's near my tablet, that's why. Uh, I don't know why, now, now I'm just imagining twi like okay, Twilight actually. in her princess form have to deal with someone <laughs> dating her mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, my pen is freaking out a bit, but we're gonna just, we're gonna try and make this work, okay? That's okay, well, yeah, we're in, we're in the sketch phase, it doesn't have to be neat. Um, at this point, yeah, wow, okay, yeah, it really does it's have to really be. Bad. Wow. <laughs> it's really bad. It's really bad. Okay, I think it's evening out now. 
Nice. There we go. So this is this is your this is your bat pony unicorn. Oh, is she getting a kiss on the cheek? She's doing something. We'll we'll see where this She's goes. Really fast. <laughs> I like it. My so God, fast. the speed. Oh, oh, oh no. my God! <laughs> yeah, I don't understand how how we want to be so fast. It's <laughs> impressive. Oh my God! She's lightning speed. She's, Look at her she's go. She's putting the moves on at a record pace. No? Oh. Oh, what? Oh, I know where I'm yeah. going with this. Don't even worry. Uh, I'm really but, hoping oh that's Twilight's dad. Oh, is that it, no, that is... That, is no, is Rarity? Twilight, no? it, it, Wait, no, I think that's Twilight's her mom. Mom. I'm drawing Twilight Velvet from Beverly here. Right, okay. I, I commissioned uh, Fizzle Fur the other day, and I was stumped at how fast I got the commission done. <laughs> like... It took like, like weeks, if not months, before finishing commissions, and I got it in like a day. Oh, oh no! God, it was my amazing. birthday on my birthday. Is Twilight's dad right? No, Twilight's right there. Okay. No, that's a Twilight. <laughs> I'm, gonna Twilight. Twilight. <laughs> I'm gonna have Twilight and her dad, and also Fizzy Whizbang's boyfriend. <laughs> just like, Hell what yeah. are you doing? And, shine, and shining armor. <laughs> Amazing <laughs> movement. Are we just getting the whole fucking the whole channel on here now? And and Cadence. And I mean, if Cadence if Cadence were there, she would be trying to make this happen. Oh, so she's like, yes. Okay. Cadence is just like, it's good when someone falls in love. I don't care. <laughs> Even though they're already married. <laughs> Lots of unicorn topic right now. Yeah. <laughs> so oh my god, this <laughs> This is amazing. I like how everyone uh, okay, I like how everyone here made it like their mission to make um the ship like smoothly as possible and then fucking fizzy like nah nah Everyone hates it. <laughs> Everyone hates it. Except Fizzy herself. She loves it. <laughs> you get me. Uh, I'm just gonna drop his wings. Uh, <laughs> really fast. This is crazy. Leave. Leave, <laughs> Leave your husband. For me. For me. Baby girl. Baby you gotta put like a little heart. <laughs> You're so right. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> this is so oh my god! This is cranked out so <laughs> fast. I'm I'm I a little I'm a little uncomfortable with the resemblance between the the fizzy's boyfriend and my pony sona. Um, <laughs> but I'm mad. I was about to say. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That looks like. Yeah. That's, Not canon. They're both blue. Oh no! They're blue as well. <laughs> Come on. He has to, he has, he's not allowed to square glasses, though. <laughs> introducing uh, okay, introducing well, Tim's new, into new pony sona. No. Now ask my boyfriend to change different. his glasses then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, sorry. <laughs> your your horse sorry. has to wear different glasses. Um, yeah, horse sorry. Your has been confiscated. Like, hi, your sorry, love you. Get down to Specsavers right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, perhaps in record time, I think I am done here. <laughs> oh my god. No really? way! No way! Quickest <laughs> one! I might have to leave this one unedited in this order is, for it to be the same length as the others. Is, like... Yeah, it, okay, leave this one unedited. Because... Alright, we everyone's saying like, something okay. really inappropriate. In the whole fucking history of our channel so far, no one has drawn this quick. Like it's we were truly... talking earlier about how how anxiety was drawing so quickly, and then, bam! <laughs> and then this was like not even half the time that it took, like less than half. Not even. <laughs> I think I think it was literally like five minutes. Like, I think it was the best. for for the for the, the record you... for the record we have been recording um, for about an hour and forty. 
This is gonna take up. It's so small now. I'm really like, good. I mean, I it's a good finale. Speed. Perfect. Yeah. I envy your um, speed. Because I, th so I thought I drew fast. Not even. Holy <laughs> shit. You're insane. So, okay, okay, now the now the, the, the true important business. A ship name. If, if this can be called a ship. Um, Velvet, and what's your character's name again, Fizzy? It's Fizzy Whizbang, isn't Fizzy? it? Yes, Fizzy Whizbang. Bang Velvet. Twilight Whiz. That's what I'm trying to do! Like, um, yeah, going? I sure hope it does. Yeah, that's the goal. Get on board. <laughs> yeah, we'll go it. with that. <laughs> I, I sure hope. I can't believe it. I was just saying, I sure hope it does. That's so funny. Okay, well, I think, I think today we've gotten, we, we've we've grown as people. I think. Um, have we now? Well, I'll be, I I have to say something. I appreciate you all being so open to this prompt and giving your absolute best oh. slash fastest. This is awesome. This is, this is so much fun. This is going to be a fun collection of art to have afterwards. Not sure there's uh, much left to say other than, Dear Princess Celestia, Twilight Velvet won't call me back. Gay people. Can you <laughs> speak to her for me? Why? Your faithful Velvet student, Fizzy Whizbang, and also the rest of the draft horses. Uh, we've got a community Discord server in the uh, in the link down below. We've got sticker packs for sale. Like, subscribe, comment. The usuals. I have been uh, your host, Tim Splosion. Uh, you can find me basically everywhere on the internet as Tim Splosion. I've been Fizzy. You can find me as Fizzlefur anywhere relevant. I've been Best at Critic. You can find me as Best at Critic anywhere relevant. I'm Anxiety Monster. Same thing. I'm anywhere and everywhere all at once. I'm Ronan. Uh, Are you? And, um, <laughs> well, well, am I? Am I now? I'm not quite sure anymore. <laughs> after after this whole life-changing experience, I'm not sure. Where can you find me? No. You At can't. your mom's house. <laughs> <laughs>